Okay, so this is just simply how to enable uh, pip in Python. You can see here I've gone to the uh, directory where any of the Python scripts are installed. So we've got um, local disk C users, um, the username, app data local programs Python, Python 3.7 uh, 3 or 37 here, uh, and then a folder called scripts. You can see we've got pip installed. Um, but what you'll find is there's a problem with um, Python accessing script or the command, the PowerShell accessing pip. For some reason in Windows 10, um, it's it's not quite installed correctly. So to do this, uh, on the right hand side it says my P, uh, this PC, just right click and choose properties. And then you're going to go to advanced system settings. And then from here, make sure you're on the advanced tab and click on environment variables. And what we need to do is just switch back to this window here. And I'm going to click up here to get it so it's a, a string of the file path. So right click and copy it. In here, we're going to go to the second box down here and you're going to want to create a new one. I've already got it made here. So you can create a new one. The variable name is going to be, uh, I called it Python 3 scripts. So if you just call it Python 3 scripts, like so. And then in this variable val valuable value, sorry, uh, you're going to right click and paste and click OK. You can see I've got it here. I'm just going to delete it because I've already got one here. So this is what you should have. Then you want to scroll up till you see uh, the variable path. And you're going to click on edit. Now it's going to open up um, a list like this. And you won't have this one here. So what you need to do is remember the exact name you gave the new variable here. You're going to click on new. And you're going to type in percent, the name of it, and then another percent sign. And then that will point towards uh, this um, folder address here. So you just click OK. OK again. And you can close out of this. And if you want to test to see if it's working, um, just load up PowerShell. So Windows PowerShell. Um, and what you can do is just type pip3. And then it should come up with a list of commands, which means it's then installed correctly and you can then install extra uh, packages and scripts from here.